Today's lesson is on finding the missing angle of triangles. And to do that, we're going to use the triangle sum theorem, um, which is the sum of the interior angles of a triangle add up to 180 degrees. Okay. So if we look at our first example here, we can use that theorem right there to help us figure it out. So we're going to say that this angle, this angle, and this angle are all going to equal 180 degrees together. So I could say 50 plus 65 plus x is equal to 180 degrees. Okay. I then can go ahead and combine my like terms. So I have 115 plus x, the 180. And I can go ahead and subtract by 115. And I get x is equal to 65. In order to make sure that works, I'm going to go ahead and check it by plugging it in. So I'm going to go ahead and say 65 plus 65, that's two of my angles, and that is equal to 130 together, plus another 50 equals 180, so yes, that does work. Number two, I have 52, 90, and x, so I'm going to go ahead and do 52 degrees plus 90 degrees plus, oops, plus x is equal to 180. Combine my like terms of 142 plus x, 180. Let's draw my line. Subtract by 142. And I get x is equal to 38. Again, I'm going to go ahead and plug it in there. I'll go ahead and add up my angles. 52 plus 38 combined is 90. Plus another 90 equals 180. So yes, that does work. Now for my third example, now instead of just having x, I actually have some um, variables in there. A little more complex, but it's going to be the same method. I'm going to take my first angle, x plus 5. I'm going to add it to x plus 10. And I'm going to add it to 125. Together they're all going to equal 180. First thing I'm going to go ahead and do is combine my like terms x and x gives me 2x. Combine my other like terms, 5, 10, and, 15, and 125, give me 140 together. Bring down my 180. Let's go ahead and subtract by 140. And I get 2x is equal to 40. Subtract by 2, and x is equal to 20. Now I'm not done just because I have the value of x. I need to actually make sure that I plug in to figure out my angle values. So I'm going to bring 20 up here, and 20 plus 5 is 25 for that value. And 20 plus 10 is 30 for that value. So now I'm going to go ahead and check it by doing 25 plus 30 plus 125. And 25 plus 125 is 150, plus another 30 is 180. So yes. That does check and that does work. So what I'd like to go ahead and do now is try three examples yourself. Just remember that all three angles adding up should equal 180. And then make sure you check to see if it works. So pause it and see what you do. All right. So my first one there is 42 plus 103 plus x. You should get a value of 35. And yes, that does check to work to 180. And my next one is I have 2x plus 3x is equal to 90. I'm sorry, plus 90 is equal to 180. Go ahead and find that my value of x is 18. I then plug my 18 in to get a value of 36 and 54. And then I check to make sure it works by adding them all up. Lastly, I go ahead and add together 3, x plus 18 plus x plus x. And I get x is a value of 54. Go ahead and plug my value 54 in to get 54, 54, and that turns to 72. Add them all up to get to check it, and then yes, it does equal 180 degrees.